Discussion on response to exercise in congenital complete heart block. Congenital complete heart block with RR interval of 1280 milliseconds, ventricular rate 47 per minute, and PP interval of 960 milliseconds, atrial rate of 62.5 per minute. The four criteria for diagnosis of complete heart block are satisfied. Regular PP interval, regular RR interval, PP interval less than RR interval and varying PR interval. Please subscribe to this channel for future updates. Click on the subscribe button. Press the bell icon after that for all updates. QRS is narrow indicating suprahesian location of the complete heart block with the junctional focus capturing the ventricle. Such a situation in a young boy indicates congenital complete heart block. An exercise test is useful in assessing the response of heart rate to exercise. In stage 1 of exercise, the PP interval has shortened to 600 milliseconds, atrial rate 100 per minute, and RR interval is 1000 milliseconds, ventricular rate 60 per minute. There is progressive change in atrial and ventricular rates with exercise, though the response is blunted compared to sinus rhythm with regular conduction. Please observe the raw rhythm strip at the bottom of the tracing. Peak exercise tracing in congenital complete heart block with PP interval 400 milliseconds, atrial rate 150 per minute, and RR interval 720 milliseconds, ventricular rate 83 per minute. Echos and colleagues reported the response to exercise of 11 patients with congenital complete heart block in the age range of 7 to 23 years. They noted similar differences in the exercise response between atrial and ventricular rates. While the atrial rate was between 160 to 185 per minute in the second workload on bicycle ergometry, ventricular rate was between 68 to 130 per minute. In another study of 8 patients aged 8 to 17 years, ventricular rate was between 36 to 56 beats per minute at rest and increased to a mean value of 106 plus minus 25 on exercise. Blank and colleagues evaluated 16 children with congenital complete heart block, 13 of whom had received pacemakers. They documented that paced children did not perform better on exercise tolerance test compared to those who were not paced. 25% of paced patients showed upper rate restriction by the pacemaker. This was despite an average programmed pacemaker upper rate of 182 plus minus 11 beats per minute. Here are a few important journal references. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for future updates and click on the bell icon for all updates. Thank you.